you know, I'm going to be 30 next year, and um, it's nice to, at the age of 30, be able to get my juices flowing again. It's, it, it, I've, I had a great time doing the first two shows, and uh, it added days to my life. Doesn't it make you just a, a bit nervous putting a 100-pound dumbbell near a world-class Steinway? I will stay away from the piano. <laughs> When they called and said, would you do it, I, I leapt at it. You know, it's... Thanks, Chief. I'm here to protect the character as much as I can and make sure he's being taken care of by the writers, and he has on this show. And action! The multi-camera sitcom is a writer's medium. As a director, you have to respect what they do and their work, and yet you must deal with your actors so that the actors feel like they create something too. It just doesn't feel organic to wait. It'll be so organic on film. <laughs> he is the GOAT. James Burroughs is the GOAT. And I can see in my work how he's influenced me. He said something that I really took to heart. Don't forget to play. Go in and try things. Welcome aboard. It's been years since I've had anyone here with any passion, excitement, or even vital signs. Here I am, this black woman, grew up in Philly, raised by a single mom, but me and my sister were Frazier and his brother. I always wanted to see what happened to Frazier after it ended. I have just executed a masterful spell of parenting. Wonderful. And right on time, as Freddie's in his formative mid-30s. <laughs> it's about this show, this version of the show. I didn't really go back to the past, although there's elements of it. I kind of looked at it as something new. Really, coming in and working with Kelsey the, for the first time in this situation, I was kind of excited. And for the final category, wine. Ooh. Oh, stand back. I've got this. Well, this one this one showed me pretty much everything is, you know, about the actual work of the cameras. My notion about directing was I needed to never slow anybody down. So it took me a long time to figure it out. You have to do the work during the week. On, on show night, it's just riding the crest of the wave. The audiences have been extraordinarily responsive. And that's one of the keys of this whole live audience thing. I mean, you know when we're off, or you know when we're on, because they tell you. It's all about the energy. When I see my actors on that stage holding and living in the laughter, it's golden. You are not there to plant the tree. You were there to put little leaves on the tree. It's been a pleasure just being here because everybody's not only so nice, but it's a collaborative effort where things just keep getting better every day. If we're having fun and doing the show, we like one another in the cast, and that will come across the screen, and you will feel the love that we all feel for one another in your home. Got it. Got it. Bravo.